It certainly does, and it shows the people who are often seen to be the biggest supporters of the migrants' welcome movement, that they too are not immune from being put behind the interests of the people smugglers' business. And quite frankly, we've seen in Yorkshire uh, um, housing accommodation built for local tenants and the local communities being used for Afghan uh, applicants who've come across on the Afghan scheme before those who haven't got housing being allowed to have it themselves. We've seen the growth of the business, in particular around Stoke, of the large companies making millions from accommodation, trying to buy up all the short holders, short tenancies, and thus shortening the amount of the market space available for local communities in the Northwest. And now housing for students. We have a mess in this country where 